Ozempic and its sister weight loss drug, Wagovi, have recently soared in popularity. The FDA updated the label of its diabetes drug, Ozempic, to acknowledge reports of blocked intestines in some people who are using it. News Channel 3's Lisa Feinstein spoke with experts about what you need to know. Diabetes drugs like Ozempic and Wagovi have been all the rage in the weight loss world. At times it's been hard to even maintain a supply of the medication because there's been so much interest um, and, and so many prescriptions to be filled. Dr. Matthew Weimer is chief medical officer at Valley Health. He says as more people take these drugs, more people have been reporting some serious side effects. There is anywhere from about a three and a half to four and a half times increase in patients who are on these types of medications to have what we might call an ileus or a, an intestinal obstruction, which can be very, very serious. The medications mimic a hormone the body naturally makes to slow the passage of food through the stomach, which helps people feel fuller longer. This has led to intestinal blockage in many patients to the point that the FDA is now requiring a warning on the label. In certain cases it can be quite severe any blockage of the intestine is potentially life-threatening while serious weimer says the overall risk of these complications is low like any medication it's a better fit for some than it is for others it's an opportunity to have that conversation with your provider about the risks and the benefits because every single medication that we prescribe all day long i'm prescribing medications that have risks and that have benefits these medications have been proven safe and effective for many people if they're the right candidate and if they commit to a healthy lifestyle. Weimer says side effects may be more prevalent in those who have existing gastrointestinal problems. There's no magic pill or injection that's just going to make it better and not have any potential risks. It's really important to understand that you, you, you have to put in some work. It can be a viable option for some to reach their goals, but the risks involved warrant a conversation with your doctor. Lisa Feinstein, WSAZ News Channel 3. So if you do plan on taking these drugs, it's important to know research shows most people gain the weight that they lost after they stopped taking the medication anyway.